Shut up and sit down. Welcome back, guys. Uh, guess what? This is take number three of the stage one of the Route of 40 uh, rally that we're doing. Uh, very first time, we uh, <laughs> we got to stage, uh, not stage, to waypoint 73, which was the next to last, last waypoint. The game crashed. I'm playing on the Legend difficulty. There's no auto saves during the whole stage so you have to restart the whole thing take number two i get to about waypoint 69 i got utterly lost i took a wrong turn no way to find my way back uh i just went up at the mountains i got stuck uh <laughs> it was a disaster oh my god i i, I just can't believe it all right so ooh, again we are racing on a legend uh, so with legend, we are actually, we have to control the road book ourselves. Uh, I might've took a wrong turn right there, but I know this will get me back to you. This is, this is only the third time I've done this stage. Uh, so I kind of will be able to remember. I hope I can remember where I got lost because that was just ridiculous. Okay, I'm going to reset that about right there. I have to control my uh, kilometers at the top and also the roadbook advancing uh, since we're playing on Legend. So no auto saves again. Oh, here's Sam Sunderland. Oh, shit. AI still does their crappy. I could follow him all the way till the end, but he would go so slow. I'd have to let him go. A little bit faster than me, but I could literally follow him. No, nope, he's he's acting stupid. So we're just going to blast past him. I'm good until I get to the end there. Where am I at? Here we go. But this game changes when you go to a uh, legendary difficulty. And this game better not crash on me again. It that was that was just ridiculous. All right, we need to quit this road right up here. We're going to head at 38. Just keep going. I'm going to go into the Rio down here. Hang a left. Burp, burp. I need to make up as much time as I can. Uh just to okay gotta make a left up here at 17.6 cause if I get lost again I just need to have as much distance between me and the other competitors so I, I can I can I can dick around for a little while in the desert and not lose all my positions oh man this sucks it's the third time literally that I've had to run this stage uh, but like I mentioned Changing. Okay, I gotta. I gotta keep up on these roadbook here. It's hard to talk and do the roadbook at the same time. You. This game changes. You have to concentrate a hundred percent more than playing on the lower difficulty level. All right here comes the bridge. Twenty-five point eight five. Pretty dead on with the kilometers there. But I am playing as a Toby Price, Australian KTM rider. Uh, you cannot see it right now, but there is a, they definitely made a mistake on Toby Price. He is wearing Sam Sunderland's helmet. It actually says Sam Sunderland on the back of the helmet. I don't know how they messed up and did that. Uh, oh man, how could they do that to Toby? Can't even get his helmet right in the game. Try to avoid the rocks. You can pick up damage in this game. This is the first time. If this is your first time watching the Dakar, uh, any of the Dakar videos that I've done. Uh, again, this is, uh, oh, let me get that 42. The Dakar is one of uh, Fist's rally raids. It's a two week long race. 
and like on the motorbikes here we are we have to navigate they have this navigation on their right here on their their instrument cluster here the roadbook they have to follow that uh follow different gps settings and, and whatever else um and when you're on the bike it's just you it's just you you can follow other competitors and sometimes they do work together especially if they're teammates uh but you can follow somebody and they could be lost um Okay, 42, we passed that. Keep going, we have to make a left at 50. And there should be a GPS setting also. A waypoint, GPS waypoint. But this game is 90% navigation. Uh, that's, what you're, that's what you're doing. You have to navigate to these waypoints correctly. Um, the physics again on this game, not the best, but you're not playing this game for the physics or the actual really riding. You're, you're doing it for the navigation, seeing the scenery, uh, trying to finish these. Okay. I'm at 50, 98. There should be a left turn right up here. There we go. My mileage is still pretty spot on. All right. Under the bridge at a hundred. Take a right at 160, uh, 54. Yeah, there we go. All right, we did that. I got to remember to advance it manually. 59, we're taking a right, right up here. 60, 45, we're exiting the rear. See, this one is, I don't like this. That note messes me up every time. It says we're like exiting the Rio, but look at it. And uh, now it says we're on an actual road. It doesn't seem like a road to me. Okay, we're gonna get back in the Rio at 62.30. I just missed it. Yeah, we're we're good. We're right here. Whew. Hit the speed zone right here. All right, made it to the first checkpoint. First time through this section right here, right after this uh, passage control zone, I got lost a little bit. I had to backtrack. I think I hooked up with Andrew Short. He showed me the way through. Uh, definitely a little bit confusing. It shows it as being like our actual road. It's, I guess it is, but this area right here is confusing. Dip right here through the water, just past that. Just keep on in the Rio here. So the Route of 40 is one of the two DLC rallies that they released for free for Dakar 18, the game. Uh, the Route of 40 and the Inca, I forget what the actual full name of the Inca rally is, but they are just uh, part of the Dakar series. Um, I believe they must have been. I don't know if they're still running these rallies, but in 2018 they did. Um, they were uh, just additional rallies that they held throughout the year down in uh, South America. Kind of, I want to say as warm ups possibly for the Dakar. Because uh, it looked like from the actual results, a lot of the top top guys were there. Right past that, okay. Staying in the Rio. This is just a little narrow stream though that they have me following. Keep on going at 200, yep.
Avoid the rock. Be a GPS waypoint coming up. Take the left fork at ninety seven. A little bit of air there. So you can pick up damage on your bikes. Uh, you can repair them uh, during the rally, during the stage. You'll take a time penalty depending on how bad the damage is and what you're actually uh, trying to repair. Um, if you take terminal damage, you have to... Uh, well, in my case, I am playing the legendary status. I would have to actually withdraw from the rally. I wouldn't be able to restart the stage. I'd have to or restart the whole stage um, in the lower competitor and rookie uh, rookie difficulties you can okay we're gonna make this left up here you can uh what am i trying to say you can restart at the last waypoint <laughs> all right at 102 we should be getting off of this so yeah it's farther up can't take water damage your electronics okay I'm gonna just uh, calibrate my distance okay it's at a uh, 102 I gotta put that up 102 10 close enough all right so I could advance my kilometers there oh stay on the road stay on the road gotta make sure I'm going to oh here we are at a control zone again Yeah, you can advance your kilometers at the top of the screen there just to, uh, you know, if you get lost, uh, you want to try to keep your, so you have an accurate, that's the only way you can really tell that you've gone the correct distance from the last checkpoint. Oh, and of course I have... Okay, there we go. 105. We need to make this left right here. Straight on. Making good time, I think. Oh, we are like four waypoints ahead of uh, Matthias Walker right now. So we are making good time. Lean back, Toby. Let's get some more speed. There's that one that we crossed. Okay, CX. I could not figure out what that means. I, I have a cheat sheet of rally navigation. I could not find what CX means. Any of you guys know what that means? I mean, we're coming up to a bump or a jump. And uh, it's got to have... It doesn't say danger or anything, so I'm not exactly sure what it means. 113 and then we are going to make this turn right here. One eighteen, we just keep going. We're going to have a little jump. So you see it has a little mound that's going up. That means it's going to be a bump. Uh, if it's going the other way, it's going to be a dip. Here we go. 118. Get some air. Ooh, that seemed like a hard impact. I don't know. I saw some red on my, uh, okay. At 121, we are going to hit this Rio right here. And again, this is only my third time coming to the stage. So I kind of remember some of this stuff. Um, there is this next one coming up, the ORN. That means, uh, ruts. Uh, in this particular part, it means, uh, it's going to mean uh, mud and I can avoid the mud by by cutting the corner right here. Don't get stuck in the mud, just cut it. So I hit the waypoint, cut the mud. That corner is full of mud. All right, 136, another 10K, and we got to exit this Rio. QT, the Rio. 
HP means off piece. That means uh, that's French for Or's piece. Piece is just the track or trail. Uh, so Or's piece means off the trail. And right now I'm just following this Rio. I hope I'm following the right one. I saw a couple crossroads there. Okay, 136. I gotta go to 136. Exit and just follow that cap heading on 317. Okay, getting close. 136.71. Somewhere right here. Yeah, I'm just going to go through 17. All right, and then we're going to go to 149. We've got to go cross country, get in the Rio. So I noticed on Legendary 2, uh, this is why this lost in uh, my last playthrough, take two on this stage. Uh, you have to be pretty close to those waypoints. It's, it, at least that's what it seemed like to me for those GPS uh, waypoints to activate. Um, actually, I think I was just so lost. I just took a wrong turn. Um, I actually did come across waypoint 73 accidentally, but I would have missed like three waypoints in between the last that I had actually made. Uh, so I would have taken a 20 minute penalty on each waypoint that I missed. So. I was like, no, I don't want to do that. Whoa, total price catching some air. He needed to bust out a whip there. Gotta watch out though. I think on legendary, you probably pick up a little more damage. And yeah, if you pick up terminal damage, uh, you'll be seeing take four of this. So again, this is, I'm commenting live on this one. And so this is the third time I've had to comment on this damn stage. <laughs> okay, so we made it here. I'm gonna adjust that 149.72. Close enough. Take a left. Okay, and now we need to follow this. Uh, 265 MOI. MOI means always follow the Rio. I'm pretty sure that's what it means always follow. I could not figure out what uh, TJS and DS means. One fifty-two. Okay, keep following. I'm going to use my uh, rear brake, kind of slide around these uh, turns here. All right, we're looking for 160. Keep going. One sixty two. E three means narrow. Uh, so yeah, this this has been narrow for quite a while. 
try to go cross country here, but I don't want to. You can't lose that. Don't lose the Rio. It's not really a river. It's more of a creek bed. Oh yeah. Okay, I gotta make sure. 167. We are gonna be exiting the Rio. Okay, I'm gonna get uh, so 167, 5, 4, close enough. Alright, go 280. Following this track. At the next one, we will, at 170, we're gonna hit a 205. I think I hit that before. Oof. 115. Oh man. Do not take damage. So yeah, awesome environments uh, in this game. I love it. I could ride all the way to those mountains if I wanted to. Okay, wait, let me oh, get this road. I could ride all the way to those mountains if I wanted to. Uh, you can't always, the, the mountains don't always look the best once you get there, uh, depending on where they are or are on this stage. Oh, we made a mistake there. We need to go back. Almost blue eye. Okay, I'm gonna back that up. 177.94. Close enough. Okay. 22.91. We get to get back in the river. Five fifty four, exit out, go three twenty four, cap heading. A little bit right up here at this color. Whoa. Right there's where I noticed three twenty four. One eighty nine, we're gonna Hit that main road, take a right, rejoin it. Should be right. Oh, nope, that's not a road. There it is. Right, and then we have a control zone coming up. All right, and I am riding off to the side of the road right here because. When you get on that main road, it actually slows you down. Uh, I would only be going down 110k. Off to the side, I can do 120, 126 here, 127. Uh, for some reason, however, they have the physics set. Uh, here, watch. I'll try to get over here. Let's see it slow down. See, I just I start dropping speed. I get off. And it start gaining speed. So if you want to pick up just a little bit extra time, just get off to the road. All right, here comes this. Uh... Like I'm in a speed zone, so I can't speed. Got to go less than 30 until it gets to that automatic. All right, we're getting onto the uh, man. Few more waypoints, and this is where I will have been uh, lost. First time to the stage, no problem. 
second time, I just weighed one bad turn. And, oh, man. All right, keep going. And then at 204, we're going to make a left. Twelve back in the Rio. How are we doing? We're still four waypoints ahead of Matthias Wachner. slow down there. I don't know why. I thought I was going to be at a waypoint. I'm still K off. I think the Rio is right there. There it is. All right. 216. It says there's a double danger. I don't know what the double danger is. And then we're going to hit 60 degrees. Back into the dunes for the first time in a long time. Uh, the first stages of the real Dakar, uh, the main rally, are uh, all in the dunes. You're in the dunes for so long, you get sick of them. Uh, it's kind of actually a nice change because uh, the end of the rally is all roads and scrub brush and, and things. Uh, I like this uh, getting back into the dunes. Then I'm going to go at 30 degrees. Uh, 222, go 30. Yeah, it doesn't seem like the right way. I was just a little off when I hit that one. See? Easy, easy to get lost. And if you get lost, you got to try to backtrack to a known waypoint that you just came from. Uh, hard thing is that your tracks disappear. The game doesn't keep them forever, uh, I guess with memory and whatever. Uh, so that kind of sucks. Otherwise, it'd be really nice to be able to go back. Or you got to try to find somebody that uh, find another competitor, latch onto them uh, to find a waypoint or backtrack where they're coming from. I had a hard time last time I got lost. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. Okay, go to ninety six. Uh, I'm gonna have to reset my mileage when I get to this next waypoint. I just want to make sure. We are at, oh geez, that was a big one. But we are at the correct. Okay, I'm going to get up on this one. 234, yeah, see I'm a little bit off. Yeah, I need to fix that 234.91. Close enough. Okay, let's go to 25. Whoa. Okay, go to 280. Now, this is right where I started getting lost last one. Okay, so 330. There's some rough 
off road here. So at 2.40, I'm going to cross a trail, it looks like. Oh, I picked up some damage on my bike. I'm not going to stop there. It's probably my tires. At least that's what I noticed on this, this stage before. I got to make sure that I, I actually hit this. Okay, so then once I hit this, I'm going to go 3.30. Three thirty, and then at two forty-four. Okay, there's a big rock. I probably won't remember that. I hope I don't need that. I'm not gonna remember where that's at. Two forty-four. I'm gonna hit fifty. All right, we're on the right track. Fifty. All right, made it farther, farther than we did last time on take two. All right, we're going to two forty-eight. Nice thing is we have GPS waypoints at all of these. All right, then we're going to take a left to 320. Right, increase that a little bit. Okay, let's go 320. Alright, I think we're on... Ooh, this is going to be rough. Concentrating hard here, guys. <laughs> I gotta finish this rally. Don't crash. Don't crash. Game, please do not crash. All right. Hit 82. They're probably going to gain on me a little bit at the end of the stage because I, I am just taking it easy, especially in this off-road here. I am not going to fix this damage. Ooh. Try to avoid these huge rocks, though. Going to get to 259. Jesus, this is rough. Oh, yeah. I know where this one's at. I know where this... This is a waypoint that I found before. It's down here on this road. Do not bust the bike, though. There we go. There we go. Okay. Two fifty nine fifty. I'm gonna roll that back. Okay, we're at it. I think we're following this Rio to two fifty nine. Yeah, I think we're still in the Rio. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, yeah, we're past that. Keep going. It's narrow. Uh, which way? Which way? Oh, Jesus. Do not get me lost here. It's got to be this way. OK, 
Okay, at 265, we're gonna catch a road. Let's see that. Oh man, do not get lost. Do not get lost. This makes me think that I am lost. I'm going back. I can't believe I got lost. At least I know where I came from there on this one. We might have to wait for a guy. I don't want to wait for anybody, but... Here, here comes somebody. Shit, he's already catching up to me. Aha, there was our problem. He's ripping. Okay, I think this is where we take this right, which is at 265. Oh, crap. Okay. All right, and then we're gonna, at the crossing, keep a little bit left. My mileage is a little bit off. Right there, we're going this way. I'm pretty sure that's what I just did. Oh, shit, I'm lost again. Nope, nope, look, there he is. Wait, here he comes. Jesus, I am lost. I'm just going to assume this is the way. Where is he? Here he comes. I literally, I'm so messed up on my mileage right now. I got to see where he's at. Okay, okay, he's going this way. Which little waypoint we're at. But it seems like we're going to follow main road all the way to the end. I hope. All right, we're, we're gunning. We're, we're just going to hope that it's this way seems like it's gonna be if not we are screwed and we're gonna have to just go back but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure we're good man we got really screwed up at the end there two ninety eight okay it's a long run to the to the uh, finish line Jeez, I didn't think I had that many waypoints. I and I too got screwed up, went down that wrong way. It was pretty unclear. Navigation is definitely harder on this rally than the original. My bike is pulling to the left. I think I have some major damage to the front end or something. Where is this finish line? Oh man, I hope I, I so hope I'm going the correct way. <laughs> Jesus, I could be lost, you guys. I could be lost. I could still be lost. It has me still in the lead, so that's good. Um, coming up on 298, which should be the correct distance for the finish. Oh, man, but I, I almost don't have confidence that I am in the right spot. Oh, geez. If I am lost again...
Guys, I think I am effing lost. There it is, there it is. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. We made it. That was lucky. My bike is pretty hashed right now. Oh my god. Third time's a charm, right? Oh my god. 39 minutes. Of the, that was... Again, this game changes when you change the legendary difficulty. Oh, I cannot believe that. Alright, let's see where we're at. Fourth place. Okay, so they had some guys that were, uh, how did Sunderland beat me? Oh, because he had a little bit, he started a little bit. Well, that doesn't make sense. I overtook him on the stage and it says that he beat me by four sec. I uh, know by 20 some seconds. How did he beat me? I was ahead of him on the stage. <laughs> oh, that's really weird uh those other guys that finished ahead of me though they probably started the rally after me that they made up a lot of time so definitely the ai rides a lot faster oh my god well guys man i really hope you enjoyed this video uh man if you haven't subscribed already please hit that subscribe button tick that bell so you get notified on all my uh upcoming videos dakar 18 uh supercross the game MX versus ATV and MXGP, uh, especially with MXGP 2019 coming up. Again, guys, thanks for all your support on the channel. I appreciate it. Give me a thumbs up. Leave me some comments. Let me know what you thought, and I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks a lot.